Chris Olds, Beckett Media here. I'm at the National Sports Collectors Convention in Cleveland, and we've got a uh, Alabama Crimson Tide football collector, a school I know a little bit about. He's got a quite a unique item and an interesting story that uh, we want to tell you about. So, uh, what's your name? Where are you from? And uh, what's the item? Hi, my name's Kirk Keith. I'm from Tuscaloosa, Alabama, and I have a copy of the receipt, actually a work of art that Evan Mathis made up on Twitter, actually got viral when a New York reporter carried it, stating how bad the actual football players for the Eagles treated their rookies. Uh, the rookies got to pay $64,055.76 for an uh, evening at Del Frisco's that included... <laughs> Four thousand and some Remy Martin Louis something something over my head. I don't know what that is. How about eight grand for a uh, Schaefer Cab Hillside Select three liter bottle? Twenty grand nine seventy for some Screaming Eagle Eagle, Eagle Cabernet two thousand five, and so on and so forth. And backstory is uh, so. What's the, what's the deal on this? The backstory is when I saw the receipt on Twitter, I contacted Evan. Evan actually played for the University of Alabama. Right. He graduated from the University of Alabama. I also graduated from the University of Alabama and live in Tuscaloosa and actually worked for his uncle, which is Bob Bob. Oh, Bauer, okay. I didn't realize that. Played for the 72 Miami Dolphins. So when I got it, I sent him an email and said, hey, how much do you want for the receipt? He said, Kirk, don't worry about it. I'll send it to you. And then... The kindness of his heart, he sent me the actual receipt, two pictures. He also sent me a letter which states... That this receipt is actual, so an authentic. So, so once I got that in the mail, email, I called, well, I emailed Steve Grant and said, Hey, Steve, do you think PSA can put this in a capsule? If they can, <laughs> what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring it to the National. Yeah. Steve sent me an email back and said, Sure, go bring it to me. So yesterday I got it. Here's Evan's piece of art. So it's this is the card. actual receipt signed for a, basically a Twitter prank that, he, you know, he actually didn't go out and make the rookies spend $65,000 on food and such. Yes, and stress, a, stress that point. It so, is a fake receipt. It did and, not happen. And reporters in the Philadelphia area picked up on it thinking it was real and put him on blast. Yes. So he had fun. And if you look close, if you read the first letters, what does it spell out? R-O-O-K. What, what's the rock? Oh, yeah. Rock. rock. Paper, scissors, uh, Rochambeau. So there you go. In other words, the joke's on you, reporters. Uh, so basically, this is a pretty sweet, pretty unique piece of Alabama football history. Probably not the most impressive in your collection in terms of importance, but pretty fun. It's fun. It's going to go right beside my son, Joe Namus, and I've got him all. And you've got Bear Bryant and all these other ones, too. Bear Bryant, Mark Ingram, Julio Jones. Nick Saban, about four of his balls. A couple of Daniel Moore prints. Daniel Moore, everybody's got those. Oh, Just yes. You, got, you probably got the deluxe edition, right? Crimson Legacy. There you go. Coaching 315. All right, well, that was something cool here at the National. Evan Mathis, he's a collector himself, a very serious one. And it's also fun to not be so serious at times, too.